Rolling. We are joined by CMS head coach Kurt Blasich and student athletes Jenna Holmes and Izzy Sakota. Coach Blasich, an opening statement. Um, yeah, a little bummed. Uh, not gonna lie, it's uh, mixed emotions. I, I think you know I feel for my seniors. It was a big moment for us, and you know I thought we rose to the occasion. I think that you know a lot of us, a lot of people on the outside looked at us and said, "Yeah, they're a good team." They you know, they probably aren't a top eight team. Um, even we got the seeding, you know, we're the low seed. And, you know, come out and take the, the number one seed out in straight sets and feeling pretty good about ourselves. And, yeah, I mean, we left it out there. I think that, you know, they showed character, they showed heart. Um, our, what an environment. I think, you know, if, as proud of my, as, of my team as I am, I'm even more proud of our community because it really just showed what, uh, how welcoming they are because they were incredibly respectful to opponents to you know the NCAA who's here and done a great job in our facility and I think there's just a lot of Athena pride going around and yeah the result you obviously wish could be better but you know how these ladies put their you know their heart in their sleeve and played hard it's it's awfully hard against a team like Hope to go down 0-2 and then to just battle back and even in those first two sets I mean one point here or there I think that you know, CMS is, is right there in the match. So I'm proud of us. I'm proud of, you know, not, it's not just about the volleyball. It's a, it's about who we are as a team and as a program. And, you know, it's like I told the team in the locker room it, for these seniors, it's the legacy they leave behind and the, you know, traditions and expectations that they have now helped establish. And, you know, we'll, we'll be back. That's all I can say. Our next question is for Izzy and Jenna. What has been the highlight of your volleyball careers here at CMS? I think my highlight is just this team has done an incredible job, especially this season of defining what it means to be a part of this program. And I think Kurt said it really well. It shows in our community. And I think that's something I feel incredibly grateful for is to be a part of this program, but to also be a part of this community that supports us so well. and you know, shows up for us? I think that's a big question, and I agree with Izzy, but I also don't think I can choose just one moment. There's so many good moments that we have with our team. It's just an amazing group of girls, and each and every one of them is so amazing and brings something so unique to our team, and that's what has made us so good and so connected, and those little moments where I can just look to anyone on the team and they just give me energy or off the court seeing them around school it's just I don't know the little moments I guess I'd say. Coach can you talk a bit about this senior class what will you remember most about these seniors? Oh <laughs> I for me it's really special especially with these two because you know, you, you add the four years that they played in college, you add the COVID year, you add the two plus years of recruiting, and we're going on the better part of a decade, it feels like, knowing each other. So for this class in particular, it, it really stands out because we have just been together for so long. You know, I feel like, you know, I, I won't even know what to do with myself at graduation because it's just been such a long time. and. You know, Izzy and I joke about it all the time. I've known Jenna since she was a little girl, and uh, I can definitely say this is family, and, and it feels like family to all of us. And I'll never forget this group, but I also know that I won't have to because they will constantly be a part of my life and part of this program's existence. Next question is for Izzy and Jenna. What did it mean to you to have the whole CMS community show up to these last couple of games? It means everything. I think that before the games you like talk to your friends and you feel the support, but when you see everyone come together like that, it's really, really special. And our team would not be the team we are without everyone and all that support. I think Jenna said it really well. It means a ton that our friends, professors all show up to our matches, especially these ones. And I think you know, that's really what these schools are about and what the community is about, and it's it's priceless. I guess just last one for the players. Uh, you knew this bid was coming three years ago, and, you know, I'm sure that was winging your mind and just getting here. And then last year, we were kind of a, a 
steamroller. And then this year there were some bumps, a couple conference losses, but you really peak at the right time. And even today being down, are you, you didn't want to lose, but are you proud of the way it happened? You got here and you went down swinging and just the whole journey of that three years of getting here? I am so, 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 so proud. I can't say it enough. This, we knew we were hosting the championships and it was like a distant thing and everybody was like, we need to be in it, we need to be in it. And we did it. And we could not have done that without each and every single one of those girls on the team. And I am just so proud of literally everyone and our coaches. And obviously it would have been better if we could have gotten in the finals or could have won, but I'm just, so proud and even over the way that we played today everyone put their heart out every single person so i'm just really proud i think jenna said it well i feel a lot of pride and a lot of gratitude with you know the adversity that we've had the way we've grown from it what we've learned and the team that we are today and i think jenna said it well another last question sorry um what are your words of wisdom for the players coming in, for players coming into this program I think I would say enjoy it. I think this is a really special program and it goes fast. So enjoy your time. And another thing I would say is to remember that little girl. I know a lot of people say it, but really remember that little girl that just started playing volleyball and fell in love with it and think about how proud she would be of you. And yeah, just keep that in mind. I think to add to Jenna's points, I agree with all of those. And I think it's really about the people that you play with and the relationships that you form along the way, you know, the professor that's really excited about your matches or the girl that you play next to or, you know, your relationship with your coach, those are all things that even though you don't play volleyball for CMS anymore, they're still there. And so those would be the things that I would focus on as I come into this program. Thank you all for your time and congratulations on a great season. Thank Thanks. you.